House Minority Leader Kevin McCarthy is already laying out an America First agenda for a Republican majority if they win the House in November. This will be the most important midterm in our lifetime. First, McCarthy says he will remove far left extremists like Adam Schiff, you know, the single congenital liar that he is, the single biggest purveyor of election lies in the history of this country, and his fellow Russia hoaxer Eric Swalwell off the House Intel Committee, as well as Congresswoman Omar from the House Foreign Affairs Committee, and that's not all. My man's Kevin McCarthy is coming after absolutely everybody. If you're on the left, if you're a Democrat, if you have anything to do not with the Republican Party, Kevin McCarthy, he's going to come after you, and that's why we can't let them win. Well, we can't let the Republicans win for many a reason. However, this is definitely just one of them. But of course, in this interview, he and Sean Hannity had to talk about January 6th. So I'm going to show you what's up with that. But first and foremost, you know who it is. It's Jackson White, co-founder, chief of content and Politiscope. And y'all are just the greatest for tuning in with us at TYT today. So let's see what these guys had to say about January 6th, because I have a lot to say about what they had to say. The first thing we're going to do, we've already asked to preserve all those records. The answer could be very clear. Why did the Democrats, when they created January 6th, pick and choose which Republicans could be on, disallowing never before in history individuals that I selected as minority leader? Why did the chair of this committee say the speaker is off limits? Why did the speaker not allow the information from the sergeant of arms, that communication with the speaker? There's two main questions you want on January 6th. Why was the Capitol so ill-prepared that day, and how do we make sure it never happens again? You cannot answer any of those questions without getting that communication, and we will get it, Sean, so we can get the answers. Now, notice how Kevin McCarthy waited to say, how was the Capitol not prepared for this, and how did this happen? He waited till the end, but first he had to, you know, say all the, why didn't my people, why didn't they let my people on the committees, the January 6th committees? You know, well, it's the same reason why you don't want a bank to investigate itself for stealing money from its, you know, from its customers. It's the same reason you don't want a police force to investigate itself for murdering someone in the streets. You don't want the criminals to investigate themselves. So people like yourself, people like Jim Jordan, you know, pretty much anyone and everyone who's right underneath Trump's thumb, right underneath his finger licking his boots, licking the black totally off of his boots. Of course, we don't want those people on the committee because what are they going to do? They're going to do everything they can to obstruct. It's pretty A plus B equals C. It's pretty 1 plus 2 equals 3. It's pretty simple. This is nothing that we haven't heard of before. But of course, the right wing eats it up every single time. They don't care about the truth. And that's why even though, you know, we show Brian Kilmeade saying Trump needs to learn how to lose, does he? Does he really need to learn how to lose? Because it seems as though Fox's audience doesn't give a damn. 